Hey guys, Indigo Priestess here, also known as Santera Lucera. Um, if you are new to my channel, welcome, hi, stay blessed, and I hope you guys are all on high vibrations. If you're not, stay tuned to my content because I will help you lift that vibration up. Okay, guys, um, if you're new to my channel as well, I'm a spellcaster, I'm a tarot reader, I um, consult and I teach people how to connect with entities and alien beings as well as how to make a pact with entities. And I help people in all forms of their personal life as well. So this is a topic that I really wanted to talk about. Okay. Becoming that which you desire to attract in your life without losing the patience to bring it into your life. I find that so many people on a daily basis are impatient for what they desire in life. And what they don't realize that is when you are impatient, and this is what was taught to me by the entities that I invoke and that I work with for years. This was taught to me before I even knew this was part of the laws of the universe. Okay? So stop being impatient. Understand that you need to trust the process because the more impatient you become, the more you push away what you are trying to attract into your life away from you. And I need to stress that out, please, because I'm not here, guys, to, to um, you know, send fairies out there. I'm here to serve my purpose as a soul living out its experience, which as a star seed, and that is to encourage people and to make you realize that you are more than what you are in the physical that you are more than what you are on the outside. Whatever your outside is right now, that is an um, indication of what you are on the inside. So if you are trying to lack, if you are trying to bring in, um, you know, love into your life and you look outside and you're like, there's no love, there's going to be no love. And if you are impatient about that love, that love's not going to come in because it's part of the laws of the universe. you got to feel that love for yourself already. Get rid of the insecurities and understand that you are a being of the oneness. Understand that you are more than just the body. Understand that whatever you are right now is who and what you will attract in the present and in the future. So if you are sad and frustrated because life isn't coming right, guess what? Life will never come right because you are sad and frustrated and the universe and your conscious, your higher self um, thinks to itself, okay, they are frustrated that life is not coming right. So let's create that experience in their life. Let life constantly not be coming right. And that is how it works, guys. That is how it works. And I will keep reminding you if I have to. What you are, whatever is on the outside of you, whether it is poverty and struggle, it is because that is what you are on the inside. The second you heal yourself and work with, with yourself and go within, you will see that slowly but surely the outside will change and it will be a reflection of the inside. One of the things that you also got to do if you want to stay on the high vibration is be careful who you bring into your home. That is of utmost importance. If you have a family member that's toxic and you know they're toxic, I would encourage you to keep playing music in the background, instrumental, calming, native Indian, um, traditional music, drumming, to keep the vibration high in your home so that that negativity doesn't come and um, uh, overpower you and bring you further down. This is something I do a lot when I have people in my home. Play the music in your home. Keep the vibrations going. Have a white candle burning. Um, keep your thoughts positive. So no matter who comes into your home, they will not be able to bring you down or your energy down because you are on such a high vibration that it overpowers theirs. Okay, guys? So whatever you are, you attract. So if you want to attract love, say, I am loved. I am worthy. If you want to attract um, a new home, Say thank you, thank you gods, thank you um, um, Astra, thank you Bilal, thank you whoever you are close with for bringing me that new house. I'm so pleased, I'm so happy, I'm so happy in my home. That is what you do. But you've got to train yourself to constantly um, um, believe it and feel it. And the more you feel it and you, the more you see it, you will experience it. And this is how the laws of the universe works, guys. Um, this was just a short video that I really felt that I needed to show and explain all my to all my brothers and sisters out there that, that you are more than the being that you are right now and life can change just by changing your mindset, guys. 
Um, if you need any form of counseling because maybe you're down and out, you can also contact me um, besides for just spell work and tarot reading. Guys, stay blessed, stay tuned for more content and bye for now.